Australian broadcaster ABC News identified the Atlantic Coast destination of Mar del Plata, Argentina's most popular beach resort, as the furthest land point from the despot leader's nuclear weapons. The claim was made as the pariah state's deputy UN ambassador Kim in Ryong warned a nuclear war may break out at any moment and claimed the situation on the Korean peninsula has reached the touch-and-go point. Mar del Plata resident Walter Ingui, whose home is 12,308 miles from North Korea's capital Pyongyang, joked, for anyone thinking of coming here, don't ever drive through our streets. You might save yourself from the fat man's missiles, but you'd come a cropper in the thousands of potholes in our roads. Leo Giordano, commenting on the website of an Argentinian newspaper which flagged up the ABC News claim, said, this is publicity paid for by our mayor to improve tourism this summer. Local Miguel Arca took advantage of the news to add, land for sale in Chapadmalal near Mar del Plata, close to the sea and with its own water pump. Horatio Jorge Pasi, describing the Falklands by their Spanish name Las Malvinas, added, if it all kicks off why don't we take advantage of the situation and kick the English pirates out of Las Malvinas? They'll be worried with what's going on over there. ABC News decided Mar del Plata, a favorite summer getaway for people from the Argentine capital Buenos Aires, was the best bet for those looking to be as far as possible from the potential wrath of the Hermit Kingdom in an article about the reach of North Korea's missiles. Australia, deemed to be in striking range following two successful tests of the Hwasong-14 intercontinental ballistic missile, has been threatened with disaster for aligning itself with the US against the country's reclusive regime.